Hello, are you listening to some cool music or something? Hello everyone, my name is Sasonis and welcome to another episode of the Ark Survival Evolved the Dev Kit. Yay, finally another Dev Kit video. And it's not because there has been an update, no no, it's just because I forgot about the dino. Or yeah, it's not a dino, I know, but I call them all dinos. <laughs> And it's about this one, it's about the Ecatina. And yeah, it is in the dev kit for a very long time now. And as you can see, everything is finished, the textures are done, and it just needs a little bit of color. So I don't know why it isn't in the, in the game yet, but yeah, it seems they have other priorities and maybe they want to change something about the snail. I don't know, but at least I'm gonna show you now. So let's start off with the Dino Dossier and then we get back to the animations. And here we are at the Dino Dossier of the Ecatina. Well, as you can read, the diet is a herbivore and the temperament is passive. And yeah, <laughs> it will be a little bit crazy to have an aggressive snail behind you. But yeah, as we can see, a human is harvesting something from it. Or at least it seems to be harvesting something. And the snail is looking back to it like, what the hell are you doing back there? <laughs> I don't like that. But let's see what it says in the Dino Dossier. Well, in the well they are found mostly in marshes and jungles. Ecatina is a very slow, very non-threatening land mollusk. It might be the safest creature on the island to hunt. And well, it only provides a small amount of meat and chitin. An easy meal is always good on the island. So, this is useful for beginners I guess. Because, yeah, it is a very slow creature and you can maybe easily kill it. So that, that's handy, you have some meat and I think it is a better way to kill this one than the Fiomia because they are running away from you when you attack them and this one can't move very fast so that's easier. And let's see what it says more. Unlike nearly every other creature on the island, Ecatina does not defecate normally. Instead it secretes a thick sticky substance. Ecatina leaves trails of this slime, but the trails are so thin that they crumble to dust quickly. So it's about the same thing as we have in today's snails. They also leave a trail of slimy stuff and yeah, it, that is very thin. So it, that, that's interesting that it uh, doesn't defecate normally. <laughs> so the slime you see behind the snail, that could be then the poop. Okay, so it is wrapped around in poop. Hmm. Okay, <laughs> well, let's see what it says at domesticated. Well, at Domesticated it says that there is a very disgusting but useful fact about Ecatina that causes tribes to seek to tame them. Its secretions are chemically similar to the semantic paste used by many tribes for building materials. Tamed Ecatina naturally build up this slime over time, which can then be collected at the tribe's convenience. So that is what we can see in the picture. The human is harvesting the slime and... <laughs> Well, it is harvesting the poop and uh, use it as building material. But yeah, it's interesting. So you can tame this one and yeah, you can see a picture of a form of them. And I don't know how handy this one will be in the future. Because we have frogs now and yeah, you can easily hunt insects for the cementing paste. So I don't know if this one will do it faster or better than the frog. But yeah, it's nice to have some competition. <laughs> And yeah, you can't ride it, but yeah, there would be no use if you could ride it because it is so slow. But it looks nice and yeah, let's go to the animations of this one. And here we are, back at the animations of the Ecatina. And like I said before, yeah, to me it looks like it is finished. Like the textures are done and it just needs a little bit of a paintbrush and some color. And yeah, then it would be finished. So yeah, to me it looks nice and... Let's go on with this animation and let's see, this is the moving animation. And yeah, like snails in real life, it is slow <laughs> and it looks slow, but yeah, I like the looks of it stretching it out and getting back together. So yeah, I like it and I like the movements of those little things here. I don't know how to call those and the eyes, they are moving as well. And let's go on with this one. And what are you doing? Oh yeah, you're the eating animation. So let's check it out. Come on, eat us. You like it? 
I bet you do. Well, at least this is the eating animation. And yeah, there's no pooping animation because as we have read, it doesn't poop. Well, not the normal way. And what are you doing, sir? Hello? Hello, are you listening to some cool music or something? Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, come on, come on. <laughs> Bring the beat on. You have some music in your house? No. <laughs> but yeah, this is the herd animation. So it is, has only one herd animation and that is this one. And I bet when you heard it, it will crawl up in his little house. And that, whoa, this is going too fast. That is this animation I want to say. So let's see, this is a little bit slower. So as you can see, it is totally going in. And what will happen here? Well, on the bottom, not much. And it is st still going very fast. But yeah, it is coming inside. So this one is an idle and yeah, that doesn't move at all. Or at least it doesn't seem to be alive. <laughs> so it doesn't like you and Maybe if it crawls in, yeah, I don't think it will be like a duty because the duty you can't almost hurt. So maybe you can hurt it at this weak spot. Or at least to me, it seems like a weak spot. And let's see it crawl out. And that is this one. And yeah, I like it. I, li I like how it crawls out, getting bigger. <laughs> and then it can move again. So yeah, just similar to the sna snail, not the snakes. Why do I want to say snakes? It is just similar to the snails we have in real life in these days. And of course, you want to tame it. Or at least some of you want to tame it. So here we have the idle animation again. And this one is going to sleep. So it is just moving its head up and bam, I'm sleeping. So a nice animation. And then it is going to this animation. This is the one in idle. So <laughs> I like how the eye, eyes are on the ground. But yeah, it is nice. I like it. Do you move? Uh, yeah, a little bit. You move a little bit. Okay. So, and what is this one? Well, this is the eating animation. And how do you eat? Uh, just slowly, like always. Just moving the head up a little bit to eat. And then dropping the eyes again and well here we have the waking up animation so guess which one is wild and which one is tamed well the, the one on the right is wild and the one on the left is tamed so nothing special about the tamed animation it moves its head a little bit more up and it moves those those tentacle things uh, near its mouth a little bit and the eyes but yeah that's it. Nothing very much special about this one. And that this is just a waking up world. So these are the animations I could find of this one. So nothing special. And yeah, it's not a real special. Yeah, it's not a dino. I know. But I call them dinos. I call everything here a dino. But it is not a special creature. And yeah, you can harvest it for cementing paste. But I bet a frog can harvest better. But yeah, that's it about the Agatina. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, then leave a like. And leave any thoughts about this snail in the comment below about the Agatina. And as always, if you haven't already and you want to see more of me in the future, then smash that subscribe button like a maniac. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye bye.